The Zondo inquiry into state corruption will continue its work well past next year's general elections, meaning there's likely to be some political fallout. Voters want answers. Explanations as to why delivery and transformation in South Africa had not been better in these 25 years of democracy. Those are very important concerns for the electorate and they will ask for accountability on that. And the longer the commission goes on, the more devastating the information that comes out of that. The Secretary General of the ruling African National Congress, Gwede Mantashe, has confirmed that he will testify, as has the President. I am going to uh, be required to appear before the Commission uh, to answer certain things as former Deputy President, uh, both in the state and in the party, uh, and also as President of the ANC. So I, I, will, I will be uh, going to give an account, yes, to the Commission uh, myself about what I knew, what I didn't know. However, some analysts say the president doesn't really have a choice. He needs to explain to the country why he didn't speak up earlier. For Ramaphosa, that could be really be the big python sitting there ready to swallow. Because yes, Ramaphosa was in there. And it was a cult time of culture of the ANC where you do not challenge the leader, where the leader is equated with a big very general good entity that is out there, that internal discipline, that was the predominant culture in the ANC. And so Ramaphosa would have to go out there and explain how subject he was to that type of culture. The Jacob Zuma era has left many party members disillusioned, and the ANC has a lot of work to do to change voters' perceptions. It would have to find a very shrewd way to balance what is coming out of the Zondo Commission with an alternative, persuade the voters that a new ANC is unfolding, that the Ramaphoria was not just a pipe dream, but that it is something that is real. The political landscape in South Africa is about to get interesting in this build-up to the elections next year. I'm Angelo Coppola for CGTN in Johannesburg, South Africa.